Hey guys, what's going on? It is Amy again with Bargain Mama and I have more pennies. I'm super excited. I found more pennies. This is quite a bit of pennies. I think also it is some more Christmas stuff that I found. So I'm super excited about that. And then just some clearance items. So again, some of these videos are going to be um, like pre-recorded. And so sometimes I watch people's pre-recorded videos and I'm like, when did they make that? Like, was it this, this? So I usually like to tell people when I make my videos, today is Saturday, the Saturday before Thanksgiving. I don't know the actual dates, but I'm sure, you know, because sometimes I'll watch someone's video and I'm like, is that from like two weeks ago that they pre-recorded that or how long ago? Um, just, I mean, for several reasons I like to know, but so I just wanted to tell you. So we did go to the U of A game today. Y'all, if you... <laughs> we go to quite a bit of the U of A football games. Again, my um, oldest son used to play football. Um, and ugh, their team this year, mm -mm, no, no, Chopper, no, no, baby. Uh, actually, their team for the past couple of years. And, but I just think it's coaching. I truly think, okay, no, sir, no, sir. Um, I really think it's just coaching. But anyways, so no, mommy said no. I'm so sorry. They're not, well, he doesn't listen. So anyways, guys, let's get into those pennies. Let's get into the Christmas and let's get into the clearance. So I got four of these and they don't show, do they show their, I think somewhere they do. Do, 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 where is their dots? Oh, well, they don't have it, but these were part of the summer. I'm trying to see if any of them have like their price or their thing on it. I just don't see them. Anyways, guys, I got these for a penny, one single little, I'm trying to see where their things were because I thought that they had tags on them. Maybe I did just scan them, but I thought that they had tags on them. Anyways, so these are outside pillows. Um, due to my little dogs, um, we usually get new pillows every year for outside because they like to take them down and then they get set in the sun and then they get sun rotted in Arizona. Your house could get sun rotted. There's so much sun. So anyways, um, I just picked up four more of these. And so this says Margaritaville on the back. I mean, these, I love these. And it says it's five o'clock somewhere on the front. I love this front part, like the margarita glass. I think that's so beautiful. Then it just, you know, at the bottom. So if you wanted to, you could take the stuffing out of these and you could fold this up and just save it for like next year, which is a good idea now that I think about, because I could use the stuffing from this for my, um, cause we're not going to be outside very much. Um, but I could use this stuffing in my Dollar Tree, um, pillow covers I got and fold these up until summer. I might do, I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to stuff my Dollar Tree pillows with these and then just fold these up. So anyways, Margaritaville. And it's five o'clock somewhere. Is this the same one? No, this one says Margaritaville on that side. I mean, these colors are beautiful. Again, these are from Dollar General, you guys. So first of all, I, again, the price, it doesn't say how much they were originally. But, I mean, these are Dollar General pillows. Look at these, the color. I mean, I think I love these colors. And it says State of Mind and Margaritaville. And then this side just says Margaritaville. And it has the parrots. So cute. Again, one single little penny. What does this one say? This one, I think, looks the same. Sorry about all the crinkling. Anyways, so I guess it doesn't have the tag on it either, but it says Margaritaville in the parrot again, and this side says the Margaritaville again. I love those colors, but I am going to take out the inside and, like I said, stuff my Christmas pillows with it. So, this one apparently is just the blue Margaritaville, and it's five o'clock somewhere. It was a little bit like, if you look right here, messed up a little bit for a penny. I was like, yeah, I'll let you, I'll let you slide right now. So, anyways, there's those for four pillows for four pennies, and I came up with the genius idea. No, but I really, I'm glad I thought of that. It's not just a pillow in the bottom, and it actually unzips. I'm just gonna take the stuffing out and put it in my other ones. So there's those ones for a penny. And then, I don't know what that is. And then I did pick this up. So if you saw my other penny video, I picked up quite a few pennies, but there were like littler pennies um, that I kind of hunted and found for. But what happened was some things pennied on Tuesday for some reason, and then some things pennied on Wednesday, which was really weird. So when I went on Wednesdays, I found like little remnants of stuff, and so I was really excited. So this is normally a $15 pool. It says H2O Go spaceship pool 
I don't know if it says how big it is, inflated 59.8 inches by 59.8 inches. Um, I will not be using this nor my children, but I got this. I'm just going to drop it off at the fire station because I got it for a penny. Some child is going to love this pool. So I love that. And then this right here, this one, oh, that did have, okay. Yeah, sorry. So this does have the square right there. And then this also has the square in it to show that it was a penny. So this is normally $5, Tropic Cool, three styles, swim board, a penny. I thought it was cute. Little Mermaid. So again, like they don't have this whole, like the reason I find kind of bits and pieces and not like huge things is because they are supposed to take the penny items off the shelf. And um, so also like you have to kind of dig for things. So sometimes like some of these will just be in with like the, like the toys and stuff and it'll just randomly be there and you'll pull it out. So that's why it's just like bits and pieces of little things on this video and the last video. And so I got that for a penny, the little swim board. Let me see. That might be all of my pennies, but I have more clearance items. So let me just grab these and then just regular items. So I did pick these up and these are just clearance and they're, no, they're normally a dollar and there's just eight counts of plates. I got them for 50 cents. But the reason I picked these up is just because we use a lot of paper plates and I don't care if it's pumpkin or Halloween or not for 50 cents, I'll pick it up. But I just want you guys to know that this coming Tuesday, so again, remember today is the Saturday before Thanksgiving. On Tuesday, two days before Thanksgiving, that all of their Halloween stuff will penny out um, at the Dollar Tree. So all of their Halloween candy, all of their Halloween, Halloween decorations, all of the costumes from before. So I mean, I'm going to be honest, if I put my kids' favorite candy in their stocking with a hollow, like a pumpkin on it instead of a Christmas tree, they're not going to be like, oh, I'm not going to eat that because no, guys. So I'm just saying, excuse me, get your Christmas stocking candy on Tuesday at the Dollar Tree because it will be a penny, one penny. So anyways, I got four of these. So it's like a dollar, two dollars for four things. So eight, 16, 24, 32 plates. Great deal. I feel like I know I got more. I don't know where it's at right now. So there might be another little random haul coming up. But let's keep looking. I picked this up for the full $4. But again, I love Nutcrackers. I do not believe that I have this one. And I just love him. He's blue and sparkly and glittery. And yes, I can't wait. I'm going to be doing my Nutcracker display tomorrow. So I can't wait to show you guys. So anyways, he was $4. So this, that's funny because I am going to do this dollar, I'm sorry, this dollar general haul was bought before, I believe my other dollar general haul, some of the items in it. So if you watched my dollar general haul on the last one, I think I showed these. So these are the Jolie's Boutiques dimensional stickers. There's 11 in here and they were $1, but I don't know if you can see them, but look at the gingerbreads and then the candy canes and then look at the gingerbread house. Oh my gosh, I love it. And they're like 3D. So that was 11 pieces for $1. I did pick this up. It just says Merry Christmas. It's the metal like mailbox, mini mailbox. <laughs> More ideas that hopefully I'm going to go through with. Um, I want to put like um, like all of the bulbs and stuff that come overflowing out of here and like, like make a village kind of scene. I don't know if I'm going to do that, but I've seen it a lot on the different videos. So I thought, oh, I'll get it for a dollar. But you all, what's hilarious? Oh gosh, this is a mess on the front. Hmm. So I would like to point out, here I am shopping, and I have seven U-Haul boxes of stuff in my garage that my husband is going to be doing a yard sale with. I believe of stuff from last year that I just knew I was going to craft with or knew that I bought on sale and was going to use at some point, and I never did. Never did. So, oh well. Um, and so then I did pick this up. I don't know. I just thought it was cute. So it is a gift tag craft kit. One dollar, twenty-five pieces, mix and match. Four point five inches by seven point six five inches. And so on the back it says over twenty-five tag combinations. Each gift tag comes with one base design, one sentiment tag, three decorative accents. You will also need glue or tape, ribbon or string. Use the pieces to build five unique gift tags. And then it says start with the base tag, attach the sentiment to the base, attach the accents to complete the look. So it gives you like these ideas back here. But since it's mine anyways, we're going to look and see what's in here. So let's see what they have in here. 
So here is this, and I mean, you don't have to make tags with it, but I just thought it was so cute for $1. Like, so, I mean, look at the little coffee mug here. I'm going to have to get a little closer. I'm like bending over, like, I don't know. So, I mean, that's not coffee. I mean, like the hot cocoa, and then this one is its own piece. This is its own piece. And then this right here says, have a holly jolly Christmas. And you can see like the tag is cut or the, the hole. And then here is this whole piece is the tag. So let's see what the next one says. Excuse me so here is another one this one has the christmas the buffalo check wrapped box um another truck this one is another present and then it has the straight like thing attachment again and then this one is the shape of this tag let's just look at them and see what we got this one right here here is santa and then over here we have this snowflake ouch and then the star and then this one says warm winter wishes and this one is the shape of that tag so nope there was one in between there so then we have this one and we have this circle here that is part of the tag the snowman here this little ornaments this right here says season greetings and then that shape tag is that okay and then on this back one we have this cute little deer with this white Christmas tree with the ornament this says Merry Christmas and I love the colors of this tag and let me just show you because I like the bottom of this tag I'm gonna I'm gonna pull this one out because I want to show you like how this tag is at the bottom hold on one second look at the bottom of that tag how it is I just love like the shape of it I think that's such a cute shape but guys that's it that's my penny slash um, Dollar General haul. Um, I, I think there's more. I'll just have to get it later. But I am going to come back and I'm doing a Dollar Tree haul. And then I honestly might have like a yard sale haul for you. But on the Dollar Tree haul, you guys have got, I'm like, if you don't watch any of my videos, you have to watch that one. I cannot believe that they came out with iron on vinyl. So I cannot wait to show you guys that. But that is my Dollar General haul, my pennies, my clearance, and just my regular Christmas items. I hope that you guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.